Welcome all of you to this video. So far, we have learned what is the meaning of frustum, what is meant by frustum of a cone. Today, we will solve the problems faced in our daily lives based on frustum of a cone. Rita wants to make a paper cap in the shape of a frustum of a cone, the height of which is 14 cm and the radii of the circular ends are 6 cm and 8 cm. If the cap is open from the side with a bigger circle, then tell Rita would be needing paper of how many square centimeters to make the cap. Pause the video to try yourself and then match your answer. Can you tell how we can find the size of the paper? Absolutely correct. For this, we have to find the surface area of the cap. Because cap is open from the bottom and closed at the top, so we will not find the total surface area. Rather, we will add the area of the closed end to the curved surface area. The area of the open end will be subtracted from the entire surface area. We will solve this question in the first way and the second way will be left for you to try. Now we mark the given measurements as follows. In the previous video, we learned that the curved surface area of the frustum of the cone can be derived from this formula. Since the closed end of the cap is circular, here we will use the formula for the area of the circle. From the formula, you can see that to find the curved surface area of the cap, we need its slant height, which is not given in the question. Now, how can you find the slant height? Well done! We can find the value of the slant height from this formula. Replacing all values on solving, we get the value of L, that is, slant height 10 root 2 centimeters. Now replace all values in these formulas. On further solving, On further solving, we get 733.48. So, Rita would need 733.48 square centimeters of paper to make a hat. Let's see another example. A bucket which is 15 centimeter deep and the radius of the upper and the lower portion of which is 20 centimeters and 10 centimeters respectively then how much water will it hold? From the question, we know that the radius of the top of the bucket is 20 cm and that of the bottom is 10 cm and with the depth 15 cm. Also in this question, the value of pi is given as 3.14. So, can you tell how much water can be filled in this bucket? For this, we have to determine the capacity of the bucket, for which the formula of volume of frustum of the cone will be used. Solving by substituting all the values, the capacity of the bucket is found as 10,990 cubic centimeters. Also, we know that 1,000 cubic centimeter is 1 liter, therefore, 10.99 litre or about 11 litres of water can be filled in the bucket. Today we learned to solve the problems faced in daily life based on the frustum of the cone.